Predict game results. Be the best and win awesome prizes. On Nivea.com. A lot of magic damage on the side, but the only physical damage dealer puts out a lot of damn damage, and that's Jinx. So this is actually a pretty decent comp coming through now. My only worry... And as you're saying about that uh, cowl on the Shen, look at the damage onto the top lane turret. This is, uh-oh, here comes the dive. Parallel Conjurgent versus Forge of the Flash. There's a double taunt coming in from Shy. Shy not on top of the Equalizer right now. He's dodged a lot of this damage. Overheat from Rumble. Now they can't get any more. Ixu is low. Ixu is not going to take another turret hit, but Shy expertly dodging those abilities. Dive has been failed. Ambition with a really long tunnel. And here we go. Ambition comes on with the Stand United. Nice. Turnaround kill from CJ. Yeah, the communication from CJ is so much more on point by Really Anakin. good. The question mark for Anakin, why are they doing this? We see the battle in bot lane. Space is falling low. So Sung Yun got the consistent damage. He's in the circle falling. Sand just snowfire flashes and gets the kill. Sung Yun needs to floor, yeah. but stays alive. Does stay alive. No TP from Shy down into the bottom. Steal. Ooh, it hits Snowflower, but doesn't get the low Lyra. And isn't going to get the, oh, steals the red buff. There you go, nice little burst. So Lyra had to use his smite, and Mad Life now coming in. There's a Shen ultimate. I think he's just gonna be bounced back and chain CC'd again. What a good Shen ult from Chai. Just fantastic. Mickey again has to use the Spirit Rush. Ambition coming through, nice knock up. Mickey is low, Mickey dies. The follow-up auto actually kills him once he gets over the wall. So Mickey wants the health potion, maybe like 400 units from base. Mickey actually taunted into tower range, misses the charm as well. Shy doesn't really have any semblance of damage, but he maxes E second, so this might be a kill. Okay then. <laughs> well, Equalizer goes down. It's a day late and a dollar station. Instead, he's just a heap of dead tails at the bottom lane. Rumble goes for the old in play, has the old again. Speaking of ults, puts it through, misses. Shy's there once again with the taunt, and they pick up the kill. It's really amazing to me how good Shy is at Shen. He knows the limit so well, he can pick up the kills, he knows how to all in. Really yeah. impressive synergy and coordination play. Those big anachronisms where, look, not a bad teleport place. Coco's going for a kill, <laughs> assassination <laughs> mission of himself. Not in space, and he's definitely gonna die. Well, so flower. That was hilarious. Was it worth? You will pay for that. <laughs> Extending deep into the enemy base. Lance the hook. Shy's gonna get there soon. It's down to 4,000 health. Go Shy, can you be the hero? Here comes the true shot barrage. Coco takes out Rumble immediately. Anarchy will get the Baron, but at what cost? Double taunt right there from Shen. Lear gonna pop over the wall, but guess who's waiting in his ambition? Double kill, Chrono Break back into the pit. Coco is there and waiting. Triple kill now for Coco. Mickey, he's gonna try and get away. Spirit Rush will save him from this fight. He's got his flash, he's not going to die. Uh, Snowflower is just going to recall and then die. Uh, he's gotten two so far and an inhibitor. And now he gets a surrender. Well, that was abrupt. 25 minutes, Anarchy surrenders to CJ Entis. They fall to that 9K deficit. Nice attempt at a sneak Baron, but it is sniffed out when they couldn't see anybody defending the tier two at the bottom side. And that prompts CJ to immediately start pushing through with that true shot barrage. Two impressive group play games from Coco, but I think you got to give the MVP to Shy that game. He was definitely on point. I can't wait to see those highlights if he gets it. Absolutely. It was the volleyball play with Mickey twice in a row that really railroaded what was an excellent laning phase for the Ari. Took out the turret like she needed to. It felt like Anarchy had made the smart adjustments to really become a factor specifically in the mid game. But.